Summer's coming up, right around the corner, getting hot, getting hot. That's why I had to move out to California. Boy, East Coast is too hot. They got a humidity heat. That ain't good if you got balls. You go to East Coast, get some of that summertime heat. Your shit is stuck to your leg all summer. You walk around town like a newborn horse everywhere you go. Hey, what's going on, Billy? How you doing, player? How you, how you doing, player? Just trying to work my shit out, dog. You know how I do. Now let's go on the movie. I'm going to the movie, dog. You know how I do. Let me get two tickets. Let me get two tickets to the show. Two tickets. I'm going to two tickets to that shit. <laughs> East Coast heat. Well, you just get Tourette syndrome as soon as you walk out the house. Hey, what's going on? It's hot, mother. <laughs> Woo! This is so goddamn hot. Summer's coming up, am I getting tight? All the women start wearing the shorts and the half tops. Ladies, half tops ain't for everybody. I know you've been doing your tie bow all winter and shit, getting your shit hard. Right. <laughs> I mean, nothing worse to go with a half top and the stomach's bloop. You're like, damn, I'm just big bounded, I'm just big bounded. Ain't no bones right here, baby. That's a belly. That's a belly. You got chicken bones and rib bones. That's some That's what you got. You ain't got your bones. Those ain't your bones. I just got a glam problem. You got a grand slam problem with Denny's. What you got? <laughs> and ladies, buy, buy, buy shoes that fit your feet. If you're going to the beach in the summertime and you want to wear your sandals and show off your little toes, make sure the shoes fit your feet. Nothing worse than seeing a girl at the beach with sandals and the sandal ends right here and her toes are right here. Just hanging over, picking up shit. Ooh, girl, that's a seashell. That's a seashell right there. That's a seashell. Ooh, girl, that's a dollar. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. Take that dollar. People ask me all the time how my life changed since I went on Black Network. I said, well, a lot of times when I go on the road, my core audience is black because I just watch BET. So this is like a lot of white people for me to see in one place. So I'm a little nervous, <laughs> you know? I ain't seen you guys in forever. Where you been, man? I miss you guys. I miss you guys. People say, you know, is it hard in a black room? I say, well, the funny thing is, man, white and black people together, that's the best show. Because somebody's going to get your joke. Somebody's going to get it. <laughs> Maybe not everybody, but somebody's going to get it. And the funny thing is, when you get white and black people together at a comedy show, white people never laugh till black people laugh first. <laughs> we ain't taking no chances on offending nobody. We just sit and wait. <laughs> How you doing, brother? Welcome, welcome. Yeah, from La Jolla, me and the wife came down. Welcome. Your chances of getting booed are increased greatly doing a show for all black people. Black people got about a 30-second one-joke time limit. If you ain't popping, <laughs> boo! 